What's up, everyone? Welcome back. All right, so yes, I am back for the very first time ever playing a game called Food Girls, which I know, kind of an interesting name for a game. Um, but yeah, this game sounded like it'd be interesting. I, I just happened to come across it when I was, you know, searching for video games to play for you guys. I'm like, Food Girls, okay, it's interesting. And this is actually a Japanese game. I don't think that this game ever had a physical release in... Um, in North America, I could be wrong on that, but the particular version that I have is the Japanese version of this game, so I had it imported from Japan. Um, but yeah, again, I thought it'd be interesting, and luckily for me, this one seems to be in English, so that's also a good thing, you know? It means I'm going to be able to actually understand what's going on, which again, kind of a good thing. So, yeah, again, I just came across this, I'm like, food girls, that sounds like it might be interesting. Fuck it, I'll pick it up, why not? And actually, for a game that I had to have imported, the price wasn't too bad, so... Yeah. Alright, well, either way, let's get this motherfucking party started. So why is it that half of the fucking visual novel games that I have played start off with a picture of this sky? I've noticed that that's a very common thing in these games. They always start off with a picture of the sky. What the fuck? <sighs> Every fucking time, swear to God. Okay. Wait, 30-something degree heat is sweltering? 30 degrees is below freezing. Why does... It, how could 30 degrees be... Oh, shit, shit. He's talking about 30 degrees Celsius. Ah, okay. Yeah, because, you know, obviously in America we go by, you know, we measure temperature in Fahrenheit. Um, so, you know, 30 degrees Fahrenheit's literally below freezing. Because 32 degrees Fahrenheit is... Um, you know, freezing temperature. Whereas I believe zero degrees Celsius is... is freezing temperature, where water freezes. But, yeah, okay, okay, yeah, I got super confused, though. though. He's like, sweltering 30 degree heat? I'm like, what? 30 degrees is below freezing, you dipshit? And then I'm like, oh, yeah, duh. They go by Celsius, probably. Well, unless they go by Kelvin, but I, I don't know what measurement they use in Japan. I'm assuming Celsius. Most of the world uses Celsius besides America because America is the special kid in class when it comes to nations. <sighs> yeah, anyway, <laughs> that's <was> funny. Because <laughs> the first, yeah, again, that really threw me off at first. I'm like, sweltering 30 degree heat? I'm like, 30 degrees is below freezing, you dumbass. And then I'm like, Oh, yeah. Duh. <laughs> Celsius. 
like the rest of the world uses. Wow, that's not creepy at all. That's interesting. Why the fuck is she wearing a bell? It's so fucking weird. <laughs> Usually a bell is something you put on like a cat or something. I don't think I've ever heard of a human like just walking around wearing a bell. God, that's something you put on like a dog or a cat or something. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, either way, we'll see what happens next time. I feel like this is a good spot to end it. So, yeah, I have a feeling this could be potentially interesting. So, yeah. Either way, stay tuned and uh, till next time. Peace out.